Hey now YouTube, Joey brings it back again. Kelly coming at ya with part two of two of my talking T206 series here. Um, I just did a video about my T206 collection. I hope you guys were able to check it out. If you haven't, I'm gonna put a link down below. It's a pretty cool little video showing another way that I like to collect trying to you know turn some of my viewers onto a specific segment of the hobby that I feel has been neglected and these are cards that are historical they're gorgeous there's hall of famous there's rookies there's everything you want in this set and despite popular belief they are within reach of almost anybody just depends how you want to do it so I showed a way to do it on video number one. I'm gonna show a second way that I like to collect, how to collect this set in particular in this video. So it's Joey Brings It. We're talking cards, West Coast Cali. Nothing else to do but show the cards. Guys, here we go. All right, guys, like I said, it's gonna be part two of my Talking T206. And as I did on my previous video, I gotta set the mood get the music in context here we go so first card up guys I'm gonna show you five more of my t206 raw collection check out this gorgeous card look at that guys Hugh Ambrose Jennings better known as Huey he was a hard nosed ball player and colorful manager for the Detroit Tigers he was known for his famous shouts of yeah on the third baseline. Two-time World Series champion, Hall of Famer, 1945. Hey, I love this card. It's not perfect by any means. There's a little crease right there in the corner. Uh, there's an, I think there's another little crease right on the top right there. I sent it in a PSA. It's probably going to grade, I say, a 2 maybe a 2.5 on a good day. But look at the centering, look at the rich colors, the yellow, the light blue, the green, amazing, historic Detroit Tiger uniform. Look at his cap, I love it. This guy was classic, man. Um, these are the type of cards that you can collect. If you guys remember on my previous video, I showed you guys a way to collect by collecting portraits. This is gonna be a different theme. Card number two, guys. Again, colors for days. The colors that just pop right off the card. Gorgeous. Look at that. Look at that bat. My goodness gracious. We're talking Sherwood Robert McGee, better known as Sherry. You guys recognize that name? Especially the guys that are really, really into top-notch, high-dollar cards. His T206 portrait error card is worth thousands of dollars. I'm not kidding. And is part of the 300 great baseball cards by Mike Payne. This is not that card, my friends, but it is a gorgeous card. Amazing. I love it, man. It, you cannot go wrong getting these old cards. Like I said on my previous video, a lot of people are afraid of collecting this set. There's nothing to be afraid of. You just have to set a budget of what you can spend per card. Like I said on my previous one, I think I haven't spent more than $40 on any of these raw examples. Let's keep up the cards here. I'm gonna get a theme going. I'm gonna show you guys at the end what we're talking about. Look at that gorgeous action shot. Beautiful. Floyd Myron Crow better known as Rube. Look at the colors on this card. Yellow sky, bright red, fire orange in the background. Does that look like a stadium in the background? What is that? I don't know what that is. There's some flags flying in the wind. Look at the green grass, gorgeous. He played from 1906 to 1912. While on the Cubs, he is credited with getting the ball into the hands of Hall of Famer Johnny Evers in the famous Merkel Boner game. So this guy goes down in history. Hey man, every guy has a story. It doesn't matter, like I said, if you're a Hall of Famer or if you're a scrub, we're all 
part of collecting and these guys are all part of the game of the history of the game and he, that was his part of history gorgeous i love it let's keep going i got two more cards that i want to show you guys talking t206 tobacco cards the most beautiful set of all time the most iconic set of all time it's over 500 cards it has some cards that are worth millions of dollars we all know the Honus Wagner, the Eddie Plank, the what I mentioned uh, a little bit earlier, the McGee error card. Some of these cards can straight up go into the millions of dollars. You're never going to complete this set. Doesn't mean you can't collect it, guys. Look at this guy right here, Nicholas Maddox, better known as Nick. He was a pitcher for Pittsburgh. Look at that undergarment striped blue undershirt it looks amazing be honest when is the last time you have ever seen that type of an undergarment under a uniform incredible this guy was a good pitcher he pitched a no hitter in 1907 he was a world series champion in 1909 again gorgeous background has a green look at that glove they're just fingers on extensions of his hand amazing guy look at the p on the hat a little bit of paper loss there on the orange background it i don't care it doesn't matter it doesn't take away from the card absolutely gorgeous guys this is the way to collect trust me i'm going to show you guys one more card in this little five card series check this one out this one is one of my favorites for sure you guys recognize that guy? Do you see that last name on there? We're talking Charles Arnold Gandil, a.k.a. Chick, better known as the ringleader of the 1919 Black Sox scandal. This guy received $35,000 for his part in throwing the World Series. We're talking nine times his annual baseball salary. We're talking history. Look at that sweater. Absolutely gorgeous. Look at the way he chokes up on the bat. It doesn't get any more vintage than that. Look at the sky, the colors, the richness. Chicago American League. The game was never the same afterward. Like I said, each of these guys have their own story to tell. That's one of the things that draw me to these cards whether it be the portraits with the gaze in their eyes, um, you know, you, you just, they're young men that were living their dream. They probably had to work on the off season, their regular jobs to support their families. You know, unless you were Ty Cobb, unless you were Cy Young, unless you were Christy Matheson. These guys all had to work jobs in the off season to support their families. There was no social security. There was no unemployment. You had to work, they got to play during the summer. Awesome, look at that Huey Jennings. I love it, man. A little bit of blue there in the background. Absolutely gorgeous. Again, the dilemma I have, like I mentioned in my previous video, do I send these into PSA or not? It costs about $10 if I'm able to get them into a bulk submission. You know, you have to usually send in over 50 of them for a bulk submission. If I send in one at a time, we're talking $20. That is PSA's straight rate, $20 a card. Um, you can get them in a bulk submission, but you know, that's a lot at one time. These holders are gorgeous, nice and thick. $3 a piece. I'm still debating. I'd like to hear your guys' view. These are all going to be low grade. They're all going to grade between authentic, maybe up to a 3, 3.5 on the greatest of days. But I don't care. They just look absolutely gorgeous when they're slabbed as well. But what did I say on the previous video and at the beginning of this one? I was going to show you guys a way to collect. The way that I collect, this is the second way I collect. First way, was portrait style. This one is gonna be the specific back edition. This is my concentration when it comes to backs. These are some of my raw examples. Absolutely gorgeous when you can get the same backs all lined up, all together. Man, they just look amazing. 
it doesn't get any prettier than that. And these are all pretty dang good examples too. There's not a crazy uh, stained one. It's just awesome. Check it out guys, a way to collect. I got my phone ringing. I closed up shop, but the phone is still ringing. I hope you guys enjoyed. This one has a little bit of paper loss. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. I'm gonna keep bringing more T206 conversations and cards. I hope you guys liked it. Hey, it's Joey Brings It, West Coast Talking Cards. See you guys, see you my friends.